we're back here at the AMRC. We're going to be talking to Alacona and AMRC to how they really benefit from Alacona products. Brian, could you tell me a little bit more about Alacona UK? Uh, yeah, Mark. Um, Alacona UK was formed about 10 years ago um, when Alacona as a company was really quite young. Um, and we started to, to work with um, software, which was aimed at the SEM market, to produce 3D models of images, which we could then measure on. The company then ventured into the optical metrology side. And uh, over the past uh, number of, say, eight years, we've actually managed to develop a very strong UK market. But it's been quite largely um, lab-based. And what we are trying to do now, and what we have started to achieve indeed, is to actually move much more into the manufacturing market or the production market. And the evolution of the products has enabled us to do that. If we take the G5 that's behind us, this is a recent acquisition by AMRC, and has enabled them to increase their productivity enormously and look at many, many more types of services. Also, as we move forward, or as we have moved forward, what we've done is we've moved much more into the automation market. And again, at AMRC, they've just purchased one of the systems to enable that to happen. Um, and we're now looking at doing in-process measurement, um, which is not lab-based. We're here in the metrology lab. Um, we have two Alacona systems here. It's two of four they have. And adjacent to us is a, is a standard metrology lab, like with the CMM. Now, with the G5, what are the main benefits to the AMRC or any customer using it? Um, the ability to measure things which are almost impossible to measure by other methods um, <coughs> or very difficult to measure by other methods. And we can measure, for example, uh, surface finish, which you can't do on a CMM. So it's the ability to measure complex surfaces. And can you measure any type of materials, Brian? Pretty much, yeah. Um, providing it's reflective, um, we can measure most surfaces. We can't measure glass, well, we can measure some glasses, but we typically we can't measure transparent products. And the other products that you got at the AMRC, are, the, are they similar systems? Uh, yes, they are. We've got two of these types of instruments here. We've got another one, which is a smaller version, and we now have a sensor, which is going to be built into a production cell. So do I take it that Alacona UK are really pushing more of your products into the manufacturing sector for the future? Absolutely. That is a, a, an absolute objective. We already have established that in some instances with automation, and yes, that is a policy for the future. With uh, AMRC, we're really looking forward to working further with them. We anticipate some more systems coming in here to help with the automation side. Tom, you head up the research element of the machining side for the AMRC. Now, I've spoken to Brian, who's the UK uh, sales director, about the portfolio of products that you've got here from Alacona. But I understand that you've actually bought something very different. But can you tell me what it is and what you're using it for? Yeah, so we're developing an automated machining test cell, which will be there to test new materials, new cutting tools, new coolants, and other machining technology. Um, what the Alacona system uh, is doing in that cell is it's allowing us to automate the measurement of the tooling and the workpiece so that we can increase the number of tests and the efficiency of that cell uh, and fully automate a lot of the testing. So the, more specifically, the, the cell will be able to uh, take the existing Alacona technology and put it on a robot and use that to come and measure your cutting tool where your workpiece surface finish and do all of that without the need for an operator. Uh, by automating that, we're increasing significantly the number of tests that we can do uh, in, in a single day. So we can explore a lot more technologies uh, with that testing uh, earlier on. So does that help you uh, look at the production element of machining? Yes, yeah, so it's, it's pre-production testing that allows us to survey more technologies quicker. So if we've got twice as many tests we can do in a day, uh, we can try out twice as many technologies. And that allows us to explore uh, a broader range of options for our tooling uh, or a broader range of properties in our cutting, tool, uh, materi in our cutting materials uh, or in our coolants. 
And that quickly feeds then into the next stage of the readiness levels where the output from that cell goes on to more feature-based trials and quickly you end up with those new technologies in the production. Uh, the other element is that we're not just uh, the only place that needs to do this testing. It's not just a research organization requirement. So there's the opportunity here for the automated testing to be rolled out into industry. Uh, and companies can be uh, looking at their products on uh, automated testing cells as well. So through the partnership we have here with Alcona and other industry members, there's much more uh, market uh, pull and uptake of the stuff that we're developing. And I, when you come to partners, Alicone is very strong here at the AMRC, but why did you choose them to actually sort of go down a slightly different path with this cell? So we work with them existing uh, measurement systems. So first of all, the, the measurement technology is the best that we have available. Um, the partnership with them is uh, also very key to make sure that we can do the integrations and see the, the route to market through Alicona and through our other members of this technology. Great. Thanks very much for your time, Tom. Thank you.